Yeah, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, thanks for checking me out. So, as I mentioned in like my past, like two to three, maybe four videos, I'm going back home to do my vacation. And let me just say, it's really, really weird calling my home a vacation spot now that I no longer reside there. Super, super weird. But anyways, I went ahead and picked up some stuff on. Let me get it. Here. Pretty Little Things. Now, this is actually my first time ordering off Pretty Little Things, and I wanted to share with y'all my experience. I'm gonna try on some clothes, and follow me on the gram if you wanna see me selling these pieces, cause you know, I'm gonna be looking real cute. I'm gonna be looking real cute under the sun. Hopefully, if everything works out. So, let's get started. Outfit okay, number one. <laughs> okay, <laughs> this is outfit number one. Okay, this is outfit number one, girl. I'm coming strong. Can you feel me? Can you feel me? Thank you, Mio. Okay, pretty little thing got me going. So what is, what is this? First of all, let me pull up my invoice. I'm getting a little carried away here. So this is the brown mesh leopard print ruched body con dress. And girl, she's cute. She's real cute. I hope y'all are really seeing this. Okay. Mm. If you see me looking over like here, I'm looking in my mirror. But girl, this is so cute. I just want to... Yo, know, I love when like, you order stuff online and it works out because like this, as I said, it's my first time wearing really anything and I, 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 I didn't know what to expect. So, so far we're starting off real good. And like there's rouging on the side like here. So like, if I wanted to get real sexy with it, I could have just, you know, rouged it up and tie it up there. And girl, serving you legs, serving you legs for days, honey. Serving you legs for days. But I will say, I will say, let me just demonstrate. Every walk I take, this dress is riding up. Okay? Walking again. She's riding up. Hello, my cheeks are about to come out. You know, you got any top curves up here? It's gonna ride up those curves. Okay? So you're gonna be walking. You're definitely gonna be walking into this a lot. Like a lot of holding it down, but nothing up here of black booty shorts or like tights underneath, kill it fix. Just make sure nothing gets exposed accidentally. Um, I could get over it. I could get over having to constantly uh, pull out my dress because she's cute. She's real cute. Okay, I don't know two. Number one is a go. I love this. All right, girl. <laughs> so this is the second dress, and I have to be honest and say this was the dress I was the absolutely most excited to get, and um, <laughs> yeah, girl, no. I came out looking hot in number one, but this one is just... Oh my God, There's, this is just all types of no on me. Like, I felt like with the hot pink, it would be real, real cute with my tan and stuff, but it just isn't flattering. It just isn't flattering on me, which is unfortunate. I was so excited about this dress. So, so excited. And damn. <sighs> so anyways, um, what's this dress called? This dress is, uh, this dress is the hot pink satin rouge lace up black back midi dress. So, at the back, it has some cute stuff going on. You know, it makes the butt look real, real nice and stuff. Like, the back, amazing. Real cute. The ruching on the side, real sexy. If you're trying to, you know, be real, 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 real sexy, bring it up, okay? And let it cup just right here under the butt. Just right there. Real cute. Still A1. My issue is the front of this dress. This, the fabric, for one, is super unforgiving um you can see all the lumps and bumps in my butt which i don't really care about like i got to the it is what it is um so that's fine but like this the whole situation is not cute like in order for it to look real good i have to like hold the dress taut hold the dress taut and even so it still isn't cute like it's just i, I don't know what's going on here and i'm looking to the side sorry um and there's like a line here kind of where they attach the top to the bottom and i'm just like y'all could have kept that y'all really could have kept that because i'm sure there was other ways to attach this some way somehow y'all could have really kept that it's just accentuating my body curves but just not in a flattering way and let me tell you getting into this dress was like trying to enter the olympics okay this whole situation confusing it took me like a good five minutes to get into this dress and um it was just not worth it for me because i just don't think it looks that great on me but the color and the style of the dress is real cute if it works for your body like this is just not this is this is not flattering so damn it number three we're going on to number three <laughs> 
Okay, so dress number three. This is the black floral satin halter, halter neck wrap bodycon dress. I'm gonna come in close so y'all can see like the fabric. It's um, satin and it has, I don't know what kind of flowers these are, but it has like flowers all over it. And this was one of the dresses I actually really want, was excited for too. I felt like it would, may have been like a hit or miss and it's definitely a miss on me because girl, like I see where they were going. I, see, I really do see where they're going, but for me, no, um, I love the back. It has a nice little back cutout action, like that, real cute. Like if I were to take a picture like this, like, hi, who me? You know what I'm saying? Like it's a real cute moment, but then the issue is the front and the way it wraps. First of all, um, it's not doing anything for my tits, okay? It's not really securing them. It just kind of lets my tits just like swing, you know what I'm saying? Like swing, 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 and I'm not into that. <laughs> I'm not into that. My titties don't need to be swinging, okay? We don't need to be adding any extra pressure on them, okay? Gravity is already doing enough. So I feel like it would have been nice if they kind of like put like some sort of, I don't know, fabric going here to attach this so that this part could like really just, you know, sit here. And then I feel like I could really finesse with it, but because that is missing, it's just not gonna work. And also, um, it's really high up here. If you're getting a little too exciting, you do a little too much, boo doo boo doo bop pump them out, like, not, not over here. So you definitely would have to wear some shorts under this, which, not a problem, but like, just, oh, it's just wrong. <laughs> it's just wrong on me. It's just not cute on me. See how high I have to tie this? It makes my tit look like it's sagging to the ground. And my tits do sag, but they don't sag this much, okay? They don't sag this much. So I need a little bit of uh, and uh. Okay, that's all I'm asking for. That's all I'm asking for. That is all I am asking for. Okay, I think this is look number four, and she's coming back. Don't mind the nips, don't mind the nips. But pretty little thing, she's trying to redeem herself up in here. She really is. First of all, you can damn near see my organs through this dress, but she's cute. She's real cute. She real tight. She real tight. She real tight. Okay, but she look good. You can see the lumps and bumps. Don't care. Don't care. I don't care. <laughs> but, oh my God, this dress. Oh, okay, and it has rouging on the side, so you know it can be can make it a little sexy, kind of make it like asymm asymmetrical if you want, or just like bring it up. Girl, I like this dress. I really, really, really like this dress. It's so sexy. Like, who me? Uh huh. Champagne is fine. <laughs> Curves. Proceed with caution. All right. Anyways, I. I really like this dress, as you can tell. Um, super cute. And I actually bought it to go with some white shoes, so one sec. So these are the shoes I bought it to wear with because in Jamaica, around the Christmas time, there's always like some sort of all-white party. And uh, this year won't catch me slipping. Last year, I didn't have like an all-white outfit that was really up to par. So, you know, I'm coming hot this year, like the weather. So these are the shoes on. This is the full fit. And I'll definitely do a better job when I actually wear it out, but I think it actually looks cute it bangs and the heels are like 2.5 inches like of height so it's not too tall but they're really cute so you know mules like i said i love comfort if you've seen any of my other previous videos i love comfort so these shoes are right up my alley super cute and i think it looks good with the dress i think it looks good with the dress so yeah and one thing I want to mention about this dress is I think the fact that it's double lined or double layered really helps because I have on like a deep purple bag, burgundy underwear and you're not seeing it. You can't see it. Like you can't see the color. You can definitely see the imprint of my actual underwear, but I'm not seeing any color bleeding through. So, you know, it gets a pass because you know it's white and when you're shopping on like these fast fashion sites, they tend to be like sometimes can be a little cheap when it comes to the white and super see through. But this one... No, so I really like this one. All right, on to the next outfit. Okay, so uh, this is the next fit. And uh, no, just no, just no. First of all, this is supposed to be a dress, right? You know those skirts, like those pencil skirts that you could buy at H&M? If I were to pull this down, I could wear this as a skirt. Like this is just basically a skirt. Um, there's no, there's nothing cute about this dress. It is super cheap, super, super, super thin, which it didn't look like on the website, like at all. Like this is super thin. I'm just covering up just so y'all like, gotta be, you know, seeing all my nipples and stuff. But, and also like not flattering at all. Like not flattering at all. Like you can basically see my butt crack. Like what's going on there? That's, 
too much information too much information i'm trying to leave a little bit of something something to the imagination and this is just like screw the imagination show it all and i'm like i'm not about that life. so next not happening nope no all right y'all so you see what i'm talking about the fact that this could be a skirt this was what i just had on in the last clip this is not a dress this is a skirt um but this is the next item um This top is really, really cute, but it just doesn't fit me. And I went two sizes up in this, two sizes up, just because I know I got, I got a little bit of a full chest and still like I'm bursting at the seams. You know, if I do a little, little you know, a little boom, 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 tits might be like, hi, no, just no. Um, yeah, like it's cute, like it's a cute top. It just doesn't fit me. Wow, <laughs> okay, something I can finally, sing praises about this outfit is so cute do you feel me you feel me i know you I, I know you think i know you think this outfit is cute this outfit wow i was thinking that the rest of the hall this hall was just going to be in the bin but like ma'am ma'am do you see this i bought this in the tall section and she tall okay for those that for those who don't know i'm five nine and a half so i'm a pretty tall girl and Oh my god, I love this. I love this so much. <laughs> That's my happy dance, by the way. This is definitely something I might wear on Christmas. I might wear this on Christmas. Are you kidding? This is definitely a hit for me. Um, it's a little big because, you know, it is stretchy. So I, you know, I may, I could have definitely gone down a size in this. Um, but even so, I still love it. I still think it looks just freaking phenomenal. Let me go up back here so you guys can kind of see. Like, I'm on my tippy toes and it's still touching the ground, which means that I should be able to wear this with heels and it still have like a nice flowing effect, kind of like just barely kissing or sweeping the ground. I love that look. And I love the cutout detail in the middle. I love the rouging in the, in the front area. Um, I love that it's connected as one in the back. Like I think it's just all types of cute and just very, very, very well designed. I really, I really, 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 really love this item. I think this is actually my favorite item thus far okay so this is the next fit and uh, i love it this is also another jump suit and i bought this in this haul section as well it definitely comes to the ground on me you can definitely get that nice little sweet moment that i love um love the color super cute i just this is perfect for like you know casual slay very nice easy breezy don't have to think too much about it and this is a hit like i really like this one and i love like this little detailing on the straps i love this little cutout right here in the front i love the little heart neckline that's going on with the little frills like i'm loving it i'm loving it i'm loving all these little details this is great okay um so this is the next outfit and it's definitely really cute but this is reminds me a lot of the green dress that i tried on earlier like it's really thin thin as thin as paper i was good i was about to cuss but i'm not going to Thin as paper, um, super loose, so it kind of makes my hips just look really wide and um, has no hold. It's basically just a long ass skirt with a split in the back because it has like a little split detailing back here, which is really cute. Um, but <laughs> where's the quality? Okay. <laughs> Even for me getting this on sale, I still wouldn't keep it. I would. I want my money back. Okay. I want my money back. Okay. I want my money back. I would not even I would not even spend $15 on this. Are you no. It's just a long skirt that y'all try to pass off as a dress. Like it's not happening. I don't I, I don't like this. I don't like this. Next, not happening. So this is the next dress, and I saw this on someone else's haul. I'll link her video down below. I freaking love her hauls. She's super funny. Always makes me laugh when she does like her pretty little thing hauls or just hauls in general. And I saw this on her and she looked up banging in it so i was just like of course i'm gonna pick it up because it's gonna look banging on me um yeah no 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 everything is not for everybody you feel me <laughs> and this is definitely one of those dresses this dress is actually really cute it looks good in person it feels good in person um i just don't like the way it is looks on my body i don't know if it's the color that's throwing me off because it's a rich brown color and I, I really love this whole trend of like brown on brown skin but I feel like this may be, I don't know, I, I don't like it. I, I, I don't know why, I just, I don't like it. Um, it's rouging all the way to the bottom. It definitely accentuate the curves. And I think in a good way, I just don't necessarily know if I like 
maybe it's not the dress maybe it's the color i don't know what it is like because the dress is nice i just not i'm just not feeling it on me i'm just not feeling it on me y'all this dress right here this dress right here this is the dress that pretty much brought me down the rabbit hole of pretty little things i seen this on the on the website and i bought all this stuff around black friday so i seen this and i was like ooh, and then added to my cart and i just kept adding stuff this is the culprit okay oh i love this dress so much it is a perfect purple perfect purple velvet dress and it has like a uh, pink glitter sparkle specks on it it looks really good it has a slit on the side and it has ruching on the side okay and i plan to i had originally bought this to wear to my office work party holiday party because we are doing like a masquerade theme and i felt like this would be really cute for what i have planned and just for the night and i just feel like it's like sexy um i don't know if i just can be mysterious but i feel like it is um got a little bit of sparkle going on i just feel like this is a beautiful beautiful dress and i absolutely love it i'm super happy it turned out well because i was a little iffy i'm just like mm. Uh, this was one of the more expensive items i kind of wish um the straps was a little adjustable just because like i could use a little bit of um space because it's just you know it's a little the, sh the straps are a little short for me i just feel like if i could like make it come down a little or just give me a little bit of space because it just feels a little tight on my back um but aside from that like it's not something that's very uncomfortable so i can definitely deal with it uh, i love this love this dress i don't think i've ever heard anyone mention this in their pretty little things haul or at least the one that ones that I've watched, but like they're some of these clothing, they smell like straight chemical. This dress, the brown dress, smell like chemicals as well. Um, not everything, but yeah, this definitely has like a weird smell. But aside from that, like it's a really cute dress. I really, really, really love love this dress, and I cannot wait to wear it. So we pretty much ended this on a bang. I just have a couple like accessories that I want to show y'all. I bought two pairs of glasses. This is one of them. They're like tortoiseshell glasses. I think they'd be really cute. This would look really good with the leopard dress that I bought. Moment. Anyways, this is what it looks like on. I'm not sure how much you will be able to tell because the stupid tag is in the front, but. Ooh. <laughs> bought it. I think I might keep these ones. I do really like them. Glasses number two are kind of like oversized. It's kind of weird that you don't get like a casing with this. Like not even like a little cheap one. You couldn't just. You couldn't give me a cheap casing for the glasses? It's just, what am I supposed to do with these? <laughs> you could, y'all could have given me something cheap. Y'all could have, pretty little things, you could give me a cheap little sleeve for the glasses, a cheap one. Okay. Sure. Anyways, <laughs> um, these are the second glasses that I bought. I, I like them. I don't know if I love them. I like them though. Maybe it's just because it's so oversized. I'm not used to glasses being this big on my face. I do like big glasses, but these are probably like the largest glasses that I own. Um, and then the shape is very funky as well. Uh, so I definitely feel like this is a pair of glasses that would grow on me. Stupid tag is annoying me. Um, I, I don't know what to do with the tag. I don't know what to do with the tag, girl. Ooh. Yeah, you know what? I do like them. Now that I'm seeing them in my mirror, and just seeing how it really frames my face fully from a distance. Love these. Love these. You hear me? The last thing I bought were these shoes. And these shoes were like $10, I think. I think they were $10. And a steal. First of all, I've tried these on already. It's like walking on a cloud. It looks like this. 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 It looks like this. And then you kind of just wrap the straps around like once and tie it so yeah that's how it's supposed to look i'm not gonna put on the other one but yeah you get the idea all right y'all so that is it for my pretty little thing haul overall as a first time buyer i would say that it's pretty much a hit or miss the things that are hitting are really nice like they really look good and the things that are like not so good they're definitely like there's no in between issue you're just gonna want to return that because quality is just not there um, I definitely would purchase from them again. I'm very happy with the things that I bought that did end up working out. So I'm really excited to wear them. And um, knowing now what I know, I definitely would manage my expectations in the future when I do place future art orders. That is it. Let me know what your favorite piece was from this haul, okay? If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up because it took me like 40 minutes to an hour to film and it's going to take me even longer to edit. So thank you so much. And if you'd like to see more content from me, be sure to subscribe and I'll see you in my next Monday will. All right. Bye.
Whoa, sis, that is not okay. See, what we're not going to do is act like that's not a problem.